Tell you the truth, this quarantine and voluntary isolation time didn't hit that hard on me because I'm so used to work at home. I have my studio set up in a office room of my apartment and I've used to work like this for a long time. So I've developed a couple methods to make best out of it. So if you are now working or studying at home, here's a couple tips and tricks I found useful to make sure my days look like this and not like this. I found out that planning and scheduling my work days at home is a really crucial thing. I used to get so confused during the mornings when I sat down in front of my computer or in front of the instrument and I had no plan. What should I do? So I tried to make the plans on the fly, but it was just really unproductive and I just found myself watching movies thinking, oh well, I just watched this one mo movie and figure out what should I do next. And basically I just wasted half of my workday. I started to do weekly scheduling and planning and my productivity at home went from there to... <coughs> Every Friday I start my day by checking my to-do lists and plan my next week work days around those. Then after every day, last thing that I do for the day is that I check my calendar and fine-tune the schedule and plan if necessary. That way I don't have to use time and energy every morning to plan my days and think what should I do next. I feel that I'm in control, I get more things done in a shorter period of time, I feel more happy about the work and stress less. When working at home I think it's important to have some kind of morning routine to flip your brains from home mode to office mode. It's kind of a ritual that you perform every morning. This is highly dependent on your living style and what kind of apartment you are living and whether you are home alone or not. But I give you example of my morning routine and encourage you to try and test and make your own routine. 6 a.m. Wake up, breakfast, make the bed, and morning wash. Small exercise to wake up your body. And 10 minute meditation. Now I was really skeptical about meditation in general, but then I read the book by Tim Ferriss, Tools for Titans, where basically the most successful people in the world, almost everyone had a morning routine where they had a morning meditation. So I decided to give it a try. And after one week having 10 minute morning meditation every day, I started to see the results that were like... <coughs> My mind was so much more ready and focused to work because of the meditation. Give it a try. Probably my weirdest morning routine is that after the meditation I walk around the house, shut down the TV and every single light except the office light. Performing this ritual tells my brains to focus only what's in the studio and what I need to do. Now you don't want to stay in a work mode at home from the point you start to work to the point where you go to sleep. I roughly end my work day at 4 o'clock even if I'm in the middle of something. Then I check my calendar for the next day. I shut down all my studio gear, disconnect all the hard drives from the computer and close the laptop. I can even say out loud, work day done. And then I change my work clothes to home clothes to tell my body that I'm off and it's time to relax. These routines help me stay in focus and productive at home and basically keep my sanity.
Obviously this tip is a bit tricky if you are in a full lockdown mode because of the coronavirus. But many people use this trick in the morning to flip their mind from home to office. You kind of commute to work even though you are coming back home. You can walk around the block or you can just walk around your house or apartment building. Now, I personally feel that I don't need to use this trick in the morning, but I usually perform a walk during the lunch time and walk to the close by store to buy food just to get some fresh air and get my mind off the work mode for a short while. I also use this often after I've stopped working in a day so that I can kind of come back home and just relax. With these kind of steps I've found that working at home can be really easy and productive. Hit me with a comment if you have any this kind of uh, tactics to work at home or if you have any questions about my ideas. Thanks for watching, hit that like button, subscribe, please stay safe and we see you on the next video.